Why are you hiding? I don't bite. Why are you talking to the trees? I'm a druid. Do you know what a druid is? No, we haven't been taught it in religious education yet. You don't have a long beard. Druids come in all shapes and forms. Men, women, even children can become druids now. A druid doesn't have to wear anything to identify to others that are a druid. A druidry is a personal journey. A druid is there to do good in the world so that the universe regains its serenity. Is that why you became a teacher? Yeah. And one should never tire of caring or learning. And learning never stops. I didn't sleep a wink last night. It looks like you had a lot on your mind. Yeah. I think it's time to move out from the darkness and into the light. The oak is considered hugely powerful amongst ancient and modern druids. The oak is a living legend, representing everything that is true, wholesome, stable and noble. Gemma, the next time that you need strength in your life, envision the oak in your mind's eye. So the next time that you're being bullied at school for being different, say, pick yourself with the oak and draw in from its endless energy. Will the oak tree give me its powers? You just need to believe. What's it like to be a druid? The trees are talking to us. They're the speakers of the forest. Listen not with your ear, but with your inner senses. And hear what they have to say. I've heard of the summer solstice, but what is it? The summer solstice marks the point of greatest light. The promise of the warmest months, of harvest and growth. As night follows day, darkness follows light, and winter must follow summer. Gemma, I've got a present for you. This is Elder, and it was carved by a druid, and it represents transition and a change in one's life.